What am I not doing? <laughs> <laughs> um, so I'm working for Flypaper TV. I'm actually the head director of the Flypaper TV department. Um, I am in, I'm in charge of my, I have interns and I basically do everything from making the phone calls to set up interviews to setting up video shoots, coming up with show content for our whole TV station. So I'm pretty much doing everything. <laughs> I really didn't know like how to see myself when I came in this program. Um, I had a pretty open mind for everything, um, and I really have a love for everything that I've learned from here. I don't, I don't know if I love one thing more than the next. My work in radio, um, <laughs> I actually, I started off here just putting together my own radio shows, um, and then I went over to VKO. And I worked over there for a little while, and it was so funny because, uh, you know, I was expecting this tough interview. And um, my interview was, come here because you're going to do this commercial. <laughs> so, and then after that, I've been on the underground uh, with my show, We Are a Movement. And um, I've been helping, actually, students now come up with their own show idea. I think I've set a pretty good example of how to come up with original show content. Um, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. Like, and that, to me, that is the best part about this is that you have no idea what's next. Um, I've been in contact with so many people, um, from a guy that works for, um, Good Morning America, who wants me to come down to New York, um, cause his friend took over Def Jam and he wants me to do actual music videos for some artists in Def Jam. So I'm excited about that. Um, I also heard that he's actually maybe taking a job here for ABC um, for six months. So that may get me in the door at ABC also. So, I mean, I don't know. Did you make good connections? Very good connections. Um, I think one of the key things that was told to us while we, when we joined the program was, one, don't burn any bridges, and two, look to your left, look to your right, because those are, these are our networking partners. Everybody that I've been in class with, we all keep in contact with each other. It's each other. If we hear about something that the other person may be interested in, we call each other up and say, hey, I heard about a job um, opportunity that you might be interested in. I know that it's not nothing that I could do, um, but I think it suits you better. So yeah, keep an open mind to everything. Don't just come in, when you come in here, I know you're gonna have your mind set on something, because something triggered you to come in here and get an interview and try to come to the school. But my, my advice would be to keep an open mind to everything because you don't know where your opportunity is going to show up at. I interned for Flypaper, um, which was something I never expected. Um, and it was so funny, I would never forget Miss Godine coming to me and saying, um, <laughs> saying that there's a guy that came in here and I told him I had the perfect people for you. And uh, we went and got this interview and Yogi talked to us for like, oh my God, for like a good two hours about what Flypaper did and what they were looking for. And I remember the first, all, the only thing that we said to him when we first got done was, well, what can we do today? And he was like, here's the camera, go out, I want you to do this. And I mean, with that, I mean, I've met so many celebrities, I've set up so much stuff. Uh, Russell Simmons, I worked for the, I've done stuff for Obama, I worked for the Rock the Vote campaign. Um, for my birthday party, I had the Rock the Vote campaign at my birthday party, passing out information as, as, as along with Vibe magazine. So, I mean, I, I've had so many opportunities. I got a chance to sit down and talk to Russell Simmons about what Russell Simmons actually does. And um, I, I mean, it's so, I've done so much stuff. I, don't, I can't even tell you everything I've done, so.